Since the beginning of military conflicts, we've been developing innovative ways of delivering lethal force. Now the battle lines have become blurred with civilian lives at stake. It's a thinking man's game out there. Today's soldier or police officer needs to be able to take a target down without taking him out. What they need is an option of using force in a non-lethal way. Designing a weapon to kill is simple. What's difficult is to use just enough force to surprise, stun, or stop a target in his tracks without taking his life. You don't necessarily want to kill people if you don't have to. A shot to kill can spark a riot. Doing nothing, not an option. Put the knife down! That's when less than lethal weapons make an impression. I'm Mac, and this is Future Weapons. In my 10 years with the Navy SEALs, I was trained to use some of the deadliest weapons on the planet. Now I'm exploring the very latest military technology designed specifically not to kill. Fort Leonard Wood, Missouri is one of the largest military training centers in the United States. It's also home to a primary Department of Defense school for non-lethal weapons. Our ideal point of impact is right around the solar plexus, abdominal region. Any questions? No questions? All right. 